the state capitol now and the proposed legislation that would allow DREAMers to drive. Yeah, right now, children of illegal immigrants cannot obtain a driver's license in Nebraska. Some argue that hurts our state's economy. KTV News Watch 7's Molly Miles reports. Nebraska's policy not only limits me to drive, but it continues to hold me back from other opportunities that can help me grow professionally. Proposed legislation by Omaha Senator Jeremy Nordquist would address that problem. Under deferred action, children of illegal immigrants are legally allowed to stay in the U.S., but Nebraska is the only state that does not allow this group, the Dreamers, to drive. Why would we want to limit their ability to work and contribute to our economy and contribute to our communities? Nordquist is talking about 2,300 deferred action recipients in our state who are just entering the workforce, but some say they've taken their Nebraska education elsewhere. But without a driver's license, it became clear that I wasn't going to find something suitable in this state, especially in rural Nebraska. Opponents suggest this law would reward undocumented immigrants. That's a lot of our opponents view. It's black and white, they broke the law, and they're criminals. Immigration attorney Diana McFarland suggests if Nebraska doesn't pass this legislation, it could affect adults wanting to apply for deferred action under President Obama's recent executive order. She also says the issue is more about public safety than politics. Saying more drivers with a license means more accountability on the road. They know what the rules of the road are, the city ordinances, and how to drive. Molly Miles, KTV News Watch 7.